everyone, so after about two weeks of playing with the second boys Fager M, I can uh, now give my, my experience with playing with this cube after two weeks. So let's get right into it. So after playing with this cube for about two weeks, um, there are a few things to note. That one, one of it is that the screen noise that I, note, I said in my first video, which you can watch up here or in the end on the description down below, uh, is no longer present. As you, as you can see here, there's not really any screen noise left. I guess that's like a out of the box thing, but after breaking, it's quite nice. Another fact is, I have not changed anything with the, I've not done anything about the magnet sounds. Of course, I've heard some people uh, they glue, glue the magnets or in fact, some, some just take out entirely because um, with my experience, the mines don't really do a whole lot in stability because the cube is still quite unstable and uh, doesn't really do much. So, you know, it, it wouldn't really affect you that much if you just took out the mines entirely. But, in my opinion, the noises that the magnet produces really isn't worth, you know, doing it all in or taking it out. So, that I'm, that I'm, it doesn't really bother me that much, so I'm just going to leave it like this for now. But yeah, besides that, cube is... Um, Relatively okay for the price, although it's, it is really unstable, uh, especially when turning, it's just really unstable. So uh, yeah, besides that, cube is overall quite good. Uh, in, in my opinion, I mean, it's okay for the price, but if you, if you have to start a budget, you sh there, there are you know, other cubes that you can get that are way, way more better. But if you really want a magnetic cube for you know, 30 ringgit, then yeah, this is a really good cube to go for. And another thing to note is that the, the, noises, the noise that the cube makes is considerably louder than why than why I referenced in, in my, in my uh, unboxing video is I would now you know reference it to about the same noise level as a Tankat version 2 or version 1 it is really loud in my opinion it's like here take a listen So in here, I don't think pick it up, but like it's really loud. It's really loud, and uh, yeah. And another thing, the fact to note that is it overturns quite a lot. This is with uh, barely any lube inside because I don't know it's, the the cube itself is quite good without any lube. So I mean, it's quite okay. But if you're going to use this as your main, I recommend putting very thick lube in this if you don't like to overshoot quite that much. Because you can see it shoot it flicks more than like one time. So I flick once. And wait, I flick once and it turns almost 180 degrees. So yeah, it also is quite a lot. And uh, yeah, this cube itself feels uh, quite cheap when you're playing with it. Like the you know the feeling of the cube itself, the sturdiness is not really there. It's like it just feels really cheap compared to maybe a Vault Tree or something. But you know for the price, I mean it's quite okay. Overall, in terms of the appearance, um, this cube looks quite okay. It's stickiless, which was the only um, choice you had. Choice I had when I was buying this cube from JPL and Cube. Well, apart from JPL, but like the only choice they had. And uh, yeah, this cube is stickless, and in my opinion, I mean stickless, are, stickless cubes are quite okay. But the problem is that you can't change the shapes of the stickers. So like this cube, I don't, I don't really fancy the shapes on this cube because you see. This part here is like really bright, and then the blue and the red is like really dark. So, you know, I like my series to be full bright. This is like I believe half bright, or a mix of both, full bright and half bright. And uh, yeah, it's quite a weird color scheme, like, like color shade in my opinion. So I really prefer the sticker, the sticker version. But uh, yeah, the series is, is fine as well. You know, it's. I I think the main gripe with skills cubes for me is that. You know, if there's loop on the pieces, it gets really slippery because there's nothing to grip onto. But this cube, I mean, feels alright. You know, the the pieces feel you know grippy. The plastic feels grippy, but you know, feels quite nice. As if my let's, so let's say for my video on the second voice feature M, um, this follow feels like you know my experience after two weeks and overall it's quite nice. This cube. It's a really nice pickup, and uh, so I haven't been uploading for the past few weeks. I've been, you know, Chinese Year and holidays and stuff. But anyways, uh, I'm back in the groove, and uh, 
check new videos every week. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. See you guys next week. I will and uh, yeah, see you guys next time. Bye. Alright everyone, so after a few weeks of playing with the uh what what's this game called again? Damn it.